In this lecture, we will be talking about what Amazon bestseller rank is, and I'll also show you in Amazon on the website where you can find it. So I use this in order to determine whether I should write more books in a specific category by looking on the Amazon bestseller rank of competitor products. So what is it? Here you can find the definition made by Amazon and it is a calculation based on Amazon.com sales and is updated hourly to reflect recent and historical sales of every item sold on Amazon.com. This rank can be used to show you or give you an idea how a product is selling at the particular period in time when you are looking at the category, at the product. And as I said, I use it in order to determine the good or bad categories. Also, it is quite good to note that there are different Amazon bestseller ranks or different lists and one of them is paid whereas the other is free. So you can see that here. So free means obviously when it doesn't cost you so the price is equal to 0, $0.00 dollars whereas free is or paid is anything else so anything above the zero dollars. And here, for example, I have gone into a Kindle book, uh, the first one for time management. And if you scroll down, you can see here the Amazon bestseller rank. And it says the number in the Kindle store. And I will be discussing more how this works and what the numbers mean and when you should try to get into specific categories when you see a specific number here but we will cover that later in the course and here you can see the Amazon bestseller rank of this book in these particular categories but we are not looking at that we will be focusing on this number instead and how this works and how you can use it in order to when you are making your research of the competing products so see you guys in the next lecture.